Yeah, man, Power 1051, Desert Storm Radio, world famous DJ Clue, Desert Storm, Chris Brown in the building. Yes, sir. Yo, man, how do you deal with the day-to-day -day with the paparazzi, man? I asked Brandy yesterday, man. Like, yeah, it's, it's crazy. Um, I hate the paparazzi, though. I ain't even gonna front. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it 100. Um, I just think it's just, it's, it's whack to me. Paparazzi is whack. Like, I think some artists need it to be hot, but I, I think yeah. this thing with me, that ain't what I'm about. I ain't about um, the flashy stuff. Like, you gotta right, see right. me every day in my everyday life. I'm more of a, I'll give you the records, I'll give you the hits, I'll give you the videos, I come to the concert, that's what it is. Yeah. But I think with the paparazzi, it's just, it kind of just makes artists, like, look whack at the end of the day, because it, right, right. it's either ain't really talking nothing positive, ain't saying that you did a concert and it was incredible or something. You actually can't say nothing, it's just pictures. It's, just, it's pictures and then you let the, the bloggers say what they gotta do. But it'd be funny, though, because you, you read some of the stuff and you be like, you, you actually sat down and logged in and got an actual account on a gossip site and wanted to talk this badly about somebody. I was like, right, right. you really don't have a life, so it's mm -hmm. cool. I, you know what? I mean, like, I know, like, you know, you with Rihanna all the time, you're doing your thing, she's doing her thing. Yeah. But you don't catch on the slack. It's like they had to pick one person to go hard against. Yeah. And usually, she's that person they pick you because you're like, you know, I got to say you're like more the, I'm not going to say innocent type, but you yeah. know, you're more of the, like, you know, you laid back. They, they didn't got at me a couple times, though. They didn't, <laughs> no, they, they little didn't, bit, little they bit, didn't bit. at me a couple times. But I just think, I just think, um, I don't know, she's, it's harder for, for women, females. Yeah, definitely, like, always. Because they, they, everybody wants to be in her shoes or Beyonce's shoes or everybody that they talk about, Alicia Keys. So it's it's always, they, they like them to the point where they hate them. You feel me? Right, right. You know what I'm saying? So with me, all, all I, I'm going to get hated, hating from his guys. So the guys are like, yeah. oh, forget Chris Brown. Whatever you know, you might get a couple girls on there that's, that act like they salty, but it's cool. <laughs> Chris, Chris, I mean, you could come out with some busted Air Force Ones. No, everyone be like, okay, he, Chris Brown has a busted Air Force One. Yeah, she yeah. can't come out with some scuff shoes. Nah. They're like they're gonna zoom in on it. They gonna, they gonna, booty <laughs> time, like she gotta scuff yeah. with her shoe. Yeah, yeah, they are gonna, they gonna, they gonna eat up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So when y'all get married, man? Never. <laughs> not, well, not no, not in my calendar. Why, I can't. Why not? I can't. I'm too young, man. I'm only 19. I ain't trying to settle down like that, like. I'm having fun now. I'm, I'm yeah, having fun? Yeah, I don't, don't want to Not too be, much fun, though, right? Nah, not too much, but I ain't trying to get locked locked down too early. You know what I'm saying? You hear Kanye's song, Love Lockdown? <laughs> yeah, see, that's him. That, that man's in his 30s. I, 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 I can't. I'm, I'm, I ain't even in the 20s yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I mean, on a day-to-day, -day, what's what's the day like with Chris Brown, man? Day-to-day, -day, um, like, if it's a free day, like, I just try to do... The, the typical stuff. I, I love, like, sneakers. So I go to the sneaker st right. store, skateboard shop, buy a whole bunch of decks or whatever. Then I get, uh, just go shopping. I do the shopping thing. Then from there, see if anybody... How is it to do unlimited shopping? It's like, buy, you know, buy everything you want and still have more money to buy everything else. That is, it's cool. Like, I, I think that's the only reason that I, um, that I, that that's the only thing that I can say that's the flashy part about the music industry. Like, I, I love doing the music because I love the music. But, like, when I was young, I was like, only only reason I really wanted the money is just to buy some sneakers and, and some clothes. So that's right. uh So now that you can buy that. all the sneakers and all the clothes and all the cars, man. What's I mean I mean, I think from now now it's it's now that I can do that, I think it's now about using my money wisely now. Like trying to do mm -hmm. businesses and set up certain things as far as that's gonna keep me uh eating for the rest of my life without without having to do that. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Now last time you was here, man, they asked you who your top five females were. Top five. Who, who, who I now, say? Rihanna wasn't in them. Yeah. She wasn't in the top five, so how did this happen, man? <laughs> I asked you about five. I said, yo, name your top five. You was like, ooh. And you was ready. You was like, yeah, let's get into that. When we come back from the break, I'm going to name my top five. Uh, but she wasn't in there, man. But, you know, I don't know there's always them diamonds in the rough. You know what yeah, I'm yeah, about? She was, she was, I, I mean, like, a lot of people don't know that I knew her before, like, the deal and all that. Like, right when we was both getting signed, both of us about to get signed to Def Jam. At the same time, I remember when Rihanna came up and performed live in the in the conference room. I remember yeah. what, when all that happened. And I and, and like I, I came like the week after with L.A. and so things didn't work out with the, like I was supposed to get signed to Def Jam, but right. I, I decided to go to Jive. You know right. what I'm saying? So because they had all they had Neo, they had her, they had Tara Marie, they had so many artists that I just I was like I don't want to be a shelved artist. I don't want to be sitting back. Right, right. So um, I mean it just we we met each other and all that. And we was always cool from about. For like two straight, two or three years, and then we just hung out more. So, it's just <laughs> we just like, hung out more. It's sounds just, it's just sounds like, real easy, Chris. Yeah, sounds just, real easy. It's just like that. Yeah, 
it's what it is, man. <laughs> man. Congratulations on that, man. That's, Appreciate that's, that's, it. That's a, um, it's a good situation to be in, man. Does it help you stay focused, like, you know what I mean? Uh... Cause you, I mean you're on you're on the road touring with her, so you have no choice but to stay focused. It's like <laughs> unless you want to you know walk into a pot and pan. Yeah, you know I, what I mean, I mean I, I, I'm pretty focused in general, but I think I think with it, with it, it's always just being uh, uh, trying to be a good guy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Try, try to stay try, try to stay grounded. But <laughs> she's an island girl. Yeah, I'm an <laughs> island guy, so I know how the island girls wild <laughs> out and they get. I mean, have you ever walked into like a Jimmy Choo heel or something like that? Nah, nah, we don't, we don't be fighting <laughs> like that. I ain't, I ain't the not fight. yet, not I, yet, not yet, not yet, not yet. Nah. I laugh, I laugh stuff off, and I walk, I walk away. I do, I do the grown man. Smart. Yeah, that's smart, that's smart, man. I don't want to hear about that, man. If y'all do fight, I don't, I don't want to hear about it in the press. Nah, you mean? Never. You know they got the pictures. They, they got shoot, everything. You shoot flying, cross your head. You doing like the matrix? They got the bullet wounds in me and all these. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright, man. Chris Brown's in the building, man. Eight hundred five eight five one five one. Y'all little whip snappers. Y'all know you want to holler at him. And my daughter's gonna kill me because she wasn't here when you was here. <laughs> but it's all good, man. It's Power 1051 Desert Storm Radio, baby.